this is Lee, licensed acupuncturist and herbalist. Today I'd like to talk about how electric acupuncture can optimize nerve growth factor. We all know nerve growth factor help slow down the degeneration of the peripheral nerves and even central nervous system. Uh, when we get older, the degeneration is becoming faster and regeneration becomes slowed down. And if we have inflammation, stress, or other medical issues, the degeneration will speed up. So how can we optimize nerve growth factors so when we have tissue damage, we can help healing faster? And in current neuropharmacology, 1996, people use nerve growth factor to speed up skin pressure ulcer and when you apply to even cornea the cornea ulcer can heal faster they also researchers tried nerve growth factor in glaucoma retinitis pigmentosa and brain trauma it all helps speed up the healing so does it mean that nerve growth factor can go as high as it should? Uh, no, the answer is optimize the nerve growth factor is the key to keep normal function and balancing the regeneration and the degeneration. In Brain Risk 2006, researchers applied low frequency electric stimulation in the rat model with inherited retinitis pigmentosa, the eye condition in which retina cells, the photoreceptor cells in the retina, degenerate much, much faster than the normal rats. So researchers use electric acupuncture for 25 minutes every day for 11 days, and they find more blood vessel growing in outer layer of retina. Why? They think the reason might be increased nerve growth factor and nerve growth factor receptor. They actually measure the level of nerve growth factor and bring derived the nerve growth factor to chemicals which can help regeneration of the nerves. And they find the level of nerve growth factor and BDNF all increased with this electric acupuncture for 11 days every day in the rat with the inflammation in the retina. So the question is that by using electric acupuncture, the nerve growth factor can go dangerously high. And the answer is, the, the answer is electric acupuncture can optimize the nerve growth factor level instead of making that to dangerous higher level. Dr. Stanner Victory, she did extensive study in electric acupuncture, and one is published in Biology of Reproduction. So Dr. Stanner Victory used estrogen create the red model with PCOS, it's the polycystic ovarian syndrome, and they measured nerve growth factors. In PCOS rat model, nerve growth factor actually increases with hyperactivity of sympathetic nervous system. So that increased the sympathetic nervous system activity lead to dysfunction of the ovaries. And that's why in modern society, so many women, even skinny women, uh, with hyperactive sympathetic nervous system can have polycystic ovarian syndrome. So researchers applied electric acupuncture in abdominal area to bring down the NGF, the nerve growth factor, and when the nerve growth factor decreasing, the rat can restore the normal ovulation with decreasing activity of sympathetic nervous system. 
That means electric acupuncture can actually optimize the nerve growth factor because in this study, nerve growth factor was decreasing with electric acupuncture, but still within normal range of nerve growth factor. So by using electric acupuncture, is just not increasing or decreasing. It is optimizing the nerve growth factor. So we're not worried about too much nerve growth factor in the body stimulates the nerve growing too much to form tumors. If you need more information about how acupuncture help optimize the nerve growth factor and other medical issues, please go to bostonchineseacupuncture.org.